And now your TV5 first alert forecast, certified most accurate by weather rate. Good Tuesday afternoon. I'm First Alert Meteorologist Matthew Mondro with your Tuesday afternoon update. And we're expecting snowfall on Wednesday. We're issuing a First Alert weather day as a result for that. This will be during the PM hours on Wednesday. That's where we're expecting the snowfall to really be most widespread and where we'll see most of our impacts for tomorrow. Now, although still really not a lot of snow, it's a very manageable amount of snow for mid Michigan. It's just that it's lining up with that afternoon drive, also the bus stops and even after school activities. So we are expecting some snow. We travel by then and also some drops in visibility once you factor in that wind and that wind will be gusting out of the northeast around 25 miles per hour just during the afternoon and during the morning that wind will be lighter and also it is worth noting that the uh, morning drive the morning bus stops on Wednesday those will all be uh, in good shape those will be unaffected we'll still be waiting for the snow to arrive uh, during that time now there's that snow moving in from the south at around 8 to 9 a.m. in our southern counties closer to the tri cities by 9 to 10 then into our northern counties by noon it's still quite widespread all through the afternoon hours that will continue even into the evening, but turning more scattered by the evening and overnight and then beginning to wrap up on Thursday morning. Now snowfall totals by Thursday morning at 7 a.m. We're looking at around one to two inches farther north and west, two to four inches from Mount Pleasant, Elma, Tri-Cities and around the Saginaw Bay, and then three to five inches into the eastern thumb and also a lot of our southern communities such as Fenton, Grand Blanc, Flint and Lapeer. There actually could be some locally higher totals in those locations too, depending on where any banding of that snowfall sets up. 70 forecast does have more snow chances, especially on Friday and Sunday. So those will be the two days that we'll watch after Wednesday. But again, we are issuing that first alert weather day for Wednesday. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go, and online for more news and weather updates.